Oh, hey. Uh, hey I'm Zach. Uh, this is Devin. Hi, Devin. Okay, she's I see stars. Yes, we are icy stars. Okay. And pumped about being on the work tour, right? Very pumped. The whole thing? Yes. Uh, no. No. 18th of July. Oh. So I you were saying it was I excited about the whole thing. Oh, yes. no. Um, all right. Well, we're going to get started. Um, you all I'm Devin, by the way. <laughs> this is Zach. So, yeah, we, 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 didn't didn't know, we didn't know how to start <laughs> off. <laughs> That's okay. Um, we are working on... This is my new friend right here. Denise. Denise. <laughs> BFF for life. Um, all right, you all are working on a second full-length album. Yeah. How's that coming? It's good. We tracked it before work tour, and we're finishing off the rest of it after, which is why we're on half, so we can right. get the yeah. rest of the record done before fall. Hopefully, have a release before the uh, year is over. Okay. Yeah. Uh, basically. <laughs> He's Zach. Yeah. I'm, You're new. Or, sorry. You didn't, you were in it and then you were gone. I'm the old new I'm the old slash middle new school. Okay. Uh, <laughs> did you, sorry. Why you cut me off? <laughs> Be a bit. Uh, he it was on the record, so he's old, but he's new because he replaced the new okay. guy that replaced him. Oh my god, I'm sorry. So, this that's my friend too. Interview. I just met him. So, I know almost uh, like Did you ever think you'd be back once you left? Or were you like. It's honestly, to me, it's a dream come true because, like, I wanted it forever, but I just, I didn't think it was going to happen because I kind of quit and it was just like, I don't know, like, at the, at the point, it wasn't a big deal, he just left us. At the point, I don't know, I, I just felt like it was, like, a better, healthier decision for me, basically. But now that I'm back and like I'm honestly just like a way better person, I'm ready okay. to just like spread the love and work to her. He's he he uh, lived the Del Taco <laughs> life. Maybe if we scoot this way and leave um, entryway for the stairs. <laughs> Join us. Swing <laughs> by. Yeah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, guys. You guys are gonna be in our interview now. They're not editing it. <laughs> okay. Um, were you all in any previous bands? Because I know you're fairly young. So was this your first band? I've been in this band since I was like 11, 12 years old. We weren't always called the same name, but yeah. the, uh, it's, been the, it's the same people. people. Yeah, I mean, me, my brother's a drummer, and uh, our guitar player Brent, he lives on, he lived around the block from me, and we've been playing music together. Mostly covers at first when I was 12 to like 14. We were playing like Take It Back Sunday, Fall Out Boy, uh, any band that every kid liked at that young age right. was. Uh, that's Do you think that helped you get popular? My I think popular. Song? I wouldn't say it helped us get popular, but I definitely would say it helped us progress. And, and learn our instruments because we kind of learned how to play and do our thing uh, together. I used to play guitar and sing and stuff, so we learned how to do our thing together. We used to play Chiodos covers, and we're from Michigan, so before the, when they were called Chiodos Bros, actually, they weren't really that big. We used to play their cover songs, so a lot of people in Michigan were like, oh yeah, Chiodos, like, represent. And they're like, yeah, we love Chiodos. Now. What do you think about their new singer? Um, you know, like, <laughs> I know from what I hear, it was. It was in the best interest of the band. Yeah. Obviously, I think that Craig Owens is a very, very idolized person. People like really idolize him and, and love the way he does pretty much everything when it comes to being a frontman. And as a frontman, I know that I uh, definitely liked a lot of stuff that he did and everything he wrote and just was amazing. But the new singer, he can sing, and I'm actually yeah. really, really yeah. excited I'm to not hear their new, new, their new track. Stuff. is really good. Yeah. I heard, I heard some new stuff that they put out, and it is really yeah. good. It's still like. I mean, the thing is, you can't really like judge a band by only their singer. Like, there's exactly. like, instrumentalists that write. Plus, anything can change. Yeah, yeah. 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 So, you know what? I know. I know the band is just like they're they're way better off from what I hear with the new guy. And they're, they're all enjoying each other's company and just writing good music. And I'm I'm excited, man. I think he's gonna do great. And I think that that you can't replace you know you can't replace a front man, obviously. And I don't think he's trying to. I think he's trying to do his own thing. Well, enough about them. Yeah, well, this is an Icy Stars interview. <laughs> okay, well, um, you all obviously live in Michigan, right? Do you think you'll ever relocate anywhere, like LA or...? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yeah. I honestly would think that I would love to move away from Michigan as soon as possible because it's just, in my eyes, a terrible place. And it has <laughs> terrible weather. Just the, the only the state thing itself is, people, is terrible. There's the people, people there I love. Right. Like, I love everyone there, but it's just like, it's just a miserable They look out for each other. Everyone knows but Michigan being in sucks. being and, and like traveling, I feel like... 
I mean, if you travel a lot, really it's live there, yeah. Right. Like it's after like, a while, we just matter really. Where yeah. You live the cool thing about living in Michigan is, it's like you live there, so it's so shitty there that everything else is just fucking awesome. It doesn't even matter where you are. You, you, can, you can be in Ohio. You can be in fucking <laughs> Delaware. You're just like hell yeah, Delaware. What's up? <laughs> Good. Everything's better. So. All right. Um, what's the harshest criticism you've ever received as a band? Uh, if any. Dude, I receive harsh criticism a million times a day, every single day. And um, there's always haters. I mean, there's right. people that are just like really like our band, and then there's just people that really will anonymously <laughs> tell us that they don't like our band, either because they really truly don't like our band, or they just don't like someone personally in our band, or just want to tell us that they don't like our band to see how we react. Or hope that we, I don't know. I, don't know, I feel like a lot of people that do that just try to make it like try, are trying to like bring out the bad in us and like make us say something to us right. so like we look like assholes but really we just laugh it off and like whatever if you don't like us don't listen to us you know? the harshest thing though I mean like I, I personally think any criticism is pretty harsh if it's like you know constructive criticism as opposed to saying yo I think you could do this a little better it's like that's cool criticism but if you're just gonna message us on our MySpace and be like you suck I'm just gonna be like well, why tell me why we suck and then maybe I can improve Give me standards. examples. <laughs> okay, um... No, I was like saying the person like... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, give me... Give me just that was I'm playing the list. third person of the game. Is our guitar player not good? Our drummer can be a little bit more in time? Tell me what you know about music that we don't, that we because can improve on. Because they Yeah, I don't know anything. I mean, just up more <laughs> Just like... <laughs> yeah, just on the longest running tour yeah. in history. Yeah, just... Uh, whatever. Um, alright, well, besides the new album, are y'all working on anything else? Like, videos or tours after work? We got some cool things in the mix. It's not really Anything nothing. You can talk about. Uh, no. <laughs> Besides, you know, the record's gonna be awesome. I mean, we're uh, we've been tracking for six weeks, just doing nothing but just making sure that every little piece of everything is perfect. And we haven't really began to mix or do anything cool with it, but just the rough tracks are sounding really cool. And I mean, we're That's excited good. to share. Yeah. More than sounding. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Definitely better than sounding. Yeah. Obviously, if it's not a bad, I wouldn't say anything about it. <laughs> right. Record, no. New, no new record yet. And when can we expect a new record out? Um, I mean... I mean, do you have like a somewhat time frame? Uh, we are taking our good old time on it, making sure that's perfect. So, I mean, hopefully by either the end of this year or beginning of next year, I mean, that's a big ratio, but, you know, <laughs> just expect it sometime. Alright. Well, is there anything else to talk about for you? Um, keep loving and supporting our band. No please, haters. Please. And if you hate on us, please tell us why. <laughs> so we can do better for you. Yes. Alright, well, you can wait. Bye. Deuces. Bye. Peace out.